Hey, this is Barry Shoulder, and we're taking a video tour of one of my gourd banjos. This is banjo number 31. This is called the Wizard uh, because it has a hand carved wood spirit wizard incorporated into the peg head. The, uh, it's all hand carved cherry wood. It's colored in acrylics. He has real dark green eyes. That's pretty, pretty cool. And he has ebony friction. Uh, violin tuners also. The uh, instrument is strung with Diadario strings. This is a custom set of strings that I've put together and uh, they're classical nylon and composite. I like them a lot. The neck is curly maple. It's not a real strong maple. Let me see if we can take a look at this as far as figuring and everything but it's nice it's naturally finished the fingerboard is fretless and it is ebony as we go down here let's zoom out a little bit the gourd is pretty big this is about an 11 inch gourd and it's about a half an inch thick. It's really thick as you can see here. Uh, real durable and has a real nice deep solid tone to it. The sound hole also has been made to match the moon on the uh, carving. So that's kind of cool and it's done in orange. The entire gourd is dyed purple to match the outfit that the wood spirit has. The head of the gourd, it's goat skin, has black tacks on it, the bridge is made out of maple, and the tailpiece is also maple. Now the tailpiece is a real simple setup here, the, it's easily removed, the gourd can be easily removed. In case uh, you should need another skin, it does have a frailing scoop there, a claw hammer scoop. So this is kind of just a brief little tour of the wizard. And away goes Mr. Wizard. Hey, this is Barry again. We're going to play the wizard now. Again, this is uh, banjo number 31, the wizard. And we're going to play a little tune called Half Past Four. <laughs> take a look at this consider some of my other banjos and take a look at my uh, website it's gourdbanjosbyberry.com thanks for looking <laughs>